rare neuropsychiatric condition was described by Jules Cotard, a neurologist from France in 1882. Cotard syndrome, otherwise known as the walking corpse syndrome, is a rare mental disorder where the person is alive but is firmly convinced that he or she is dead. The patient develop false beliefs that their body parts are missing and conclude that they don't even exist. An individual may also delude himself into thinking that he has lost blood or an organ. In some cases, people even insist that they were decomposing. One of the earliest cases of Cotard's delusion was recorded in 1788. An elderly woman was preparing a meal and then became paralyzed on one side of her body. When she regained ability to speak, she told her daughters to dress her in a shroud and place her in a coffin. Even though they denied her request, she continued to demand for many days that her daughters, friends, and their maid should accept and treat her as if she was dead. They finally gave in, putting her in a shroud and laying her out so they could mourn for her. Even at the wake, the lady continued to fuss with her shroud and complain about its color. After undergoing some diagnosis and treatment, her delusions went away, only to return after few months. This condition is rare because only 200 known cases are present worldwide. It typically exists in people with depression, schizophrenia, or other mental illnesses and is often associated with dementia. One of the cases includes a 53-year-old woman from Philippines. She was admitted to the psychiatric unit when her family were alarmed because the patient was complaining that she was dead and keep on yelling <laughs> that she smelled like rotting flesh. The woman even wanted to be taken to a morgue so that she could be with deceased bodies. Another case includes a 50-year-old male patient, native of Peru. Since his childhood, the patient was prone to isolation, fearing other people. His relatives described him as strange, weird. He was quiet and very dependent on his parents. They claimed that the patient would not bath, having no interest in personal hygiene. He couldn't sleep for several nights and was very anxious. The person displayed precategorical thinking, such as mental concretism and illusions of non-existence. Generally, people with Cotard syndrome were initially diagnosed with schizophreniform disorder due to their bizarre delusions. Treatments include psychotherapy, rehydration, behavioral therapy, and removal of offending drugs. Generally, electroconvulsive therapy is beneficial compared to other medications in treating Cotard syndrome. The cause of Cotard syndrome is unknown, but certain conditions are likely to cause it, including encephalopathy and multiple sclerosis. It can also be seen in a person subjected to stroke, subdural bleeding, epileptic seizure, and migraine. But for people with such condition, feeling corpse-like isn't an exaggeration. This unusual mental disorder makes people think they're actually lifeless. The Cotard syndrome is not fully understood and is extremely rare at any given time. However, the prevailing symptoms are striking and truly creepy. Thank you.